For those of you who are watching for the first time, welcome, welcome, welcome. Please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, and also put on the notification bell so that you're the first person to know when a new video is up. And for those of you who are return subscribers, welcome back. On today's video, we're in the kitchen. We'll be doing an egg roll. So I got this recipe from Nadia Bake on Netflix and she makes the most amazing dishes. So we'll be trying this out and it's quite an easy recipe to follow. It's less than 10 minutes to prep and just about five minutes to cook. And so let's check it out. For this recipe, you will need any type of tortilla wraps. You will need two eggs, one egg for one wrap. You will need butter. You will need bacon chopped garlic, grated cheddar cheese, salt and pepper. You will need a whisk and a spatula. I'm a fan of crispy bacon. If it's not crispy, I don't want it. And so you leave it on for about a minute or two and then you take it off the stove. Once you're done with the bacon, then we can move on to the eggs. You crack open both of the eggs and then you add your seasoning. Once that is done, you pour the milk and then you start whisking and you do so until it's nice and light and fluffy. When you're done whisking your egg, add butter into your pan and then add half of the whisked egg into the pan. Wait for it to start to cook and then once you're happy, add your garlic. Add some cheese. Be very generous with the cheese. And then also add the bacon. And add some more once you're done with that. And once you're happy, wait for it to cook a bit. And then once you're happy after the cheese has started to melt, then you just place your tortilla wrap on top of the egg and place it on as if you almost want it to stick onto the egg. Let it cook for an extra minute and then you flip it over into the pan.
once that is done you place your wrap on top of the chopping board and then you fold it up nicely and then once that is done you can cut it in the middle or you can choose not to cut it in the middle it's easier for plating if it's cut down the middle this was a very easy recipe to follow i hope you enjoyed the video please don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel and until next time goodbye